told you when I click them all the time. Yeah, exactly. When you want to call us the toxic ones, you're crazy. This guy is fired from his job for locking up the store on his break. We're on our break. You're on your break? You can leave. Okay. Get out. I'm sorry, who are you talking to like that? Get out. Who are you talking to like that? Get out. Who are you talking to like that? You can go ahead and get out. You're I will. Locking the doors? We're on our break. You're locking the doors. We're on our break. Doors. You call somebody and you tell them to come over your break. Call. Like who's here? Absolutely everything that you've done is recorded on conversation through text. What are you doing? All right. About? So you're gonna come here and record me. Yeah. As if you're doing something right, knowing that you blocked the door while there are 20 people outside. Working our breaks, This is literally. a working business. And we're on our break. And you don't work here anymore. Yeah, I don't. You're right. You're right. For good reason, too. Yeah, because you want to act like a <laughs> all the time? Yeah. That, that's, that doesn't matter. You don't it does matter. Because you're an asshole, <laughs> you want to act like one all the time? Yeah, exactly. When you want to call us a toxic ones, you're crazy. You're Truly crazy. crazy. Oh, oh, apparently, huh? And you are. We're on our breaks. We're on our breaks. Literally on our breaks. We get a break, right? Are we not allowed to get a break? What's on here? Then what's the problem? Then what's the problem? Then what's the problem? But we're on our break, so what are we supposed to do? Have people come in here while we're on a break? No, that's not how it works, because one person cannot keep up. That's crazy. Yeah. I will. Yeah. I will, for sure. You're crazy. So, quick little backstory. I have worked there for like three years, managed it for two. Everything was normal, everything was fine. I ran the store great, and no one had any complaints. Once the new management took over, um, everything completely went to sh me and my other coworker, who I worked with at the time, were both gay, and he was just very rude, aggressive, and um, hostile towards us. Which I have reason to believe he's homophobic because he did not direct that hostility towards anyone else, um, did not yell at anyone else. And so, um, during that incident in the video, it was busy. Um, people kept coming in. It was after a football game. Uh, we kept getting phone calls and like we could not handle that by ourselves. So me and my other coworker, we closed the store down because we didn't take our breaks it's, like a couple hours into our shift and like we're hungry, you know, like everyone deserves a break. Um, mind you, he's the one that creates the schedules and literally oversaw everything. So he should have foreshot of that. In the incident in the video that I posted previously, um, we were on our breaks and uh, we did put a sign outside says so close for 30 minutes, we'll return. And then before those 30 minutes were over, he came barging in, literally yelling at the top of his lungs, like just literally doing the most.